Hello and welcome. I'm going to do a quick tutorial on this scene from Ocean 13. Quite a popular scene. Fireworks go off. Show the bit of Vegas. I'm not going to be using all the same footage. It's going to be different footage at all. But it's this effect that we're looking for. So that's enough, we don't need to go that far. All right, so one of the pieces of footage I'm gonna be using is gonna be, let me see. Yeah, I'm using Ryan's time-lapse footage. Well, his version of a moving time-lapse well, faking moving, faking moving time, as you would call it. He fakes it, but it's a good technique, and his page is very good. He's got a lot of good techniques in here. If you scroll down, some good um, plugins for Final Cut, Pro, Final Cut Pro. So, if you don't know who he is, you should really go and look at him. All right, I didn't get paid to say that, by the way. He's um, he's very popular on YouTube. He's doing pretty well for himself. And I use a lot of his tutorials. Okay, so let's get on with it though. So what we need, first of all, is to bring the music in there. So I'm going to be using the same Ocean's music. So put that in. Easy. And then we're going to go to my Ocean's folder. We're going to start off with the fireworks. I got this from YouTube free. You can find many different versions up there. Let's bring this into fit for now. There you go. This should fit nicely. So, your fireworks should go up to five seconds, and that's when the music kicks in. So, I want to copy this moving time lapse. That. On Ryan's page, this is the thing he shows you. It looks like it's moving when it's not. Very good. So let's go back to my original project. Click on that, and we're just gonna paste. Why that did that, I don't know. That shouldn't have happened. There we go. There you go, so it kicks in, moving time lapse, so there, run about here, yeah. So now we need to make that split screen, so I'm just going to keep it simple for this, I'm not going to make it perfect, actually let's change that, let's make the letter boxes, so let's go to crop make sure you're on trim let's let's try 50 on the bottom that looks good 50 top okay depending what footage you got from youtube it depends on how much it crops or trim should i say different res will crop more but that looks good anyway so let's do the same here let's see what happens mm -mm -mm. crop make sure you're on trim which we are 50 50 you see it's a little different here so we're going to change it one needs to be cropped a little more, so let's do it at I don't know, 70. A little more. 75 should be perfect. That's pretty good. Alright, so now we're going to put in 
the split. So we need to go to my footage, footage oceans. Um, we're going to use this time lapse footage. So we're going to use. It's pretty cool. Pretty cool. This I like here. So we're going to use this. So this is where. We're going to transform it a little bit. Move it out. It looks good. I like that. Okay. So you transform it where it's at. Let's see what it looks like. All right, cool. So now I've transformed it. Let's crop it a little bit. Trim. Let's try 15. 15 looks pretty good. So let's try 15 on the opposite side. That's close enough for the time. But remember, I'm doing this pretty quickly. So there's no need to get. All right. So let's get this part here now. What for you? I was going to use this part here, but I'm going to change it. Let's put something else in there. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Here's pretty cool. Okay. So now we need to change this. My apologies. Go into your transform. There we go, so we can fit a little more than we could. So now go to your crop. Now if you don't want to use it, all you don't have to, but I'm just trying to make it fit a little, a little nicer. All right, which part do I like? Let's get rid of this building. If you want to move it, mm. yeah, there you go. Close to being perfect. So here it goes. It goes from there to this, and you have this look. Let's turn that music off. We don't want that. Or that. So she's somewhere in the back here. Here we're gonna to have to split this up with some other footage. So here we're going to cut. There we go. There we go. So we need to copy this again. Mm -mm. So command and copy. There we go. 
so it should be on top now. So we have to make this fit here and here. So let's start off with this one. Let's go to crop, make sure you're on trim, and you're going to go down to the bottom. Here will do. Then you're going to go to the top, and you're going to do the same thing. And there you have it. There's that effect. I'm going to do this quickly. And then we need to add some more footage to go into the middle. So, let me see here. What we're going to put in there. Ah, we have some footage from Miami. It's pretty cool. <laughs> totally different scenery. So, now we're going to have to change this. Let's try and transform this a little bit so we can save a lot of the... There we go. We're going to get rid of that part there, though. But thank you for the footage, by the way. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Crop. So let's... Down. We want the skyline of Miami as pretty. Somewhere to here. Let's go a bit further down here. Alright, let's cut this up here. Alright. If you want to move it, transform. And there you have this little. You can bring it to here. Now I'm not happy with these, so we need to make these a little bigger. So make sure you're on the Grab and show a bit more here. Very nice. Go up same here. Mm -hmm. Let's have a look. Mm -hmm. Hey, that's close enough. I could do just in this Hey, that's close enough. I could do the just in this, but I'm not going to play too much with it. So we have this now. Suddenly it goes boom. In like this. And at some point, let's hear the music. Around here. But actually, we don't have to play around with the footage too much, so let's just do it around here. Um, so, what we want to do is make this one longer. All the way down. Perfect. Now, all we're going to do is use the range tool. Copy. Command copy. Thank you. All I want is this. That shouldn't happen. I'm not sure what's going on there. So let's do it again. So let's just copy this one now. Copy. Thank you. So now you should be left with something looking like this. They're all overlapping each other. Optical, optical flow is still working. Um, so we need to change this one and this one. So all you're going to do is go into here. Sorry, my apologies. Transform. And you're going to move down. Same with the other one. Let's move that one up. All right, how's it looking? Not too smooth because this one doesn't fit so well. The middle one. So let's blade it. I'll change this one a little bit. Okay, these are not exactly level, but it will do. So change it to this. See, let it render. Once it's finished, then we'll play the whole clip and see what we got. Did it end? All right. Fast forward a little bit. Let's put it in. Same mode. All right, we're back. So, finished rendering. Should be working smoothly. Let's see what we've got. Let's hit the full screen. Mm -hmm. 
And there you go. Rift. Um, you can even go to some color correction over here. If we go to all. There we go. Color correction. We can go here, make this look a little better. I like to. Sorry, phone's going to be so nice. Get a bit of color. Yeah, I got that. There you go, different look to it. You can change around some of the footage too. There you go. Easy. Yeah, it could have been a little better over here. So that's how you do it. I'll show you the full version of my original I did. So, what is it? Projects. Which is, uh, here we go. So this is the original what I did. So open it up. So I did a better job with the color. Yeah, this one I spent a lot more time on making it look better. Okay, even that was not perfect, but you get the drift. So thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Um, if you like what you saw, subscribe to my channel. I'll be uploading some more Nikon D500 footage so you can see. And uh, some nighttime footage, maybe go up on the ISO to show you how well it copes. Uh, anything you want to see, Please let me know. Don't forget to put a thumbs up as well.